we have some serious damage that's been taking place now here in downtown Miami as these winds continue to whip here. I'm going to have you see we've got some tree limbs that have been down and flying across the road and the winds just keep whipping around and we've had some extremely strong bands come through and that's when these trees started to come down. Also just over here, I don't know if you can see it, but we had a down power line. Oh no, this car is about to go through it. I hope it sees this power line. Um, okay, it turned in before. But we saw that hit the water and sparks going up everywhere. More street signs flying across the road right now as the winds continue to whip here. Uh, gusts well over 60 miles per hour. It's hard to imagine double that in some areas uh, that will be experiencing it very soon. But just in the last hour, we have seen things extremely, extremely uh, get, get extremely uh, worse than they were before. So uh, this is a little bit calm, actually, for what we've been seeing. But it has certainly been whipping around. And uh, another area just uh, not far from here, Miami Beach, also experiencing these extremely strong winds. We we have our, our reporter, uh, Leanne Motahome there. Uh, and Leanne, can you tell me what you're experiencing? I know you saw that, that, that band that came through about 15, 20 minutes ago. And we're still feeling Leanne, it. In can fact, you hear in the me? last hour here on Miami Beach, yes, I can. Uh, I can hear you. And right now it is getting much worse on Miami Beach. In fact, in the last hour, things uh, have intensified and this is a great example of how that wind, it's coming from the east. We're at the Shelbourne Hotel here, and right past over here is where the ocean is. So that wind is whipping from the east, coming through this intersection. You can see it against the pavement. You can see it in the trees completely blown over. We've seen pieces of trees come down, and this was even before these winds started gusting more than 60 miles an hour. Our meteorologist at WPLG telling us we're getting some gusts at hurricane force winds. We have pieces of palm tree that have come down, and incredibly, this is an evacuation zone, but there are some people that did choose to stay. In fact, we have a man here that may be did not have another option. He's been here for the entirety of the storm. So this is just a bit of what we can expect. We know we have all of today to experience and we feel for our neighbors in the Keys who are getting those real hurricane force winds closest to the eye of Hurricane Irma. All right, Leanne, thanks for that report from Miami Beach. Here in downtown Miami, we're having another strong uh, band come through right now as well. Uh, we just got alerts on our phone. There is a tornado warning. They are telling people to take cover. Things are very serious here in Miami, and we will be here throughout the afternoon or throughout the morning to give you the latest updates. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.